Now, WGEL News 8's Weather on the 8s with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Good morning. It is 638 on this Friday. I have a weekend event to preview for you. The Harrisburg Marathon is on Sunday and good news. Temperatures will be perfect for running. Not quite as cold as this morning and not as cold as that blast that's coming in next week. So what we're looking at is an 8 a.m. start time. Temperatures will be in the upper 30s. Partly sunny skies through the afternoon, dry weather, light winds, and eventually we'll get up to about 50 degrees as many runners finish. Here's our News 8 Storm Team forecast today. Looking for a high of 42. Might not seem like that bad, but with the wind today, it's going to feel like the 30s all day long. So that's the thing. We have these blustery northwesterly winds, and they're going to push feels like temperatures into the 30s. Tonight, clear skies, diminishing winds. That's the key, and that's going to get us quite cold. Look at the lows here, 22 to 26, a hard freeze for the entire Susquehanna Valley. Tomorrow, after the frigid start, we'll see mostly sunny skies, still cold. Average high temperatures, they're around 56, but tomorrow we'll struggle to reach the low 40s. Live look in York, we showed you this picture a couple of minutes ago. It was clear. Now look at these clouds. These are those stratocumulus clouds that come in with colder air right across the Great Lakes. So out of these clouds today, you might see a flurry, but it's not going to slow down your travels. Currently 35 degrees in Harrisburg. We have 34 in Lancaster, 34 in Chambersburg. Remember, that's half the story because we're adding about a 10 to 15 mile per hour wind to those temperatures and it makes it feel like the 20s. So when you step outside this morning, the air is going to feel dry. It's going to feel a lot colder than it did yesterday at this time. Live here on Super Doppler 8, you can see that brisk northwesterly flow crossing the Great Lakes, producing those lake effect snow showers. If you do see anything today, it'll be very light in our neck of the woods and most likely in our northern and westernmost counties. Let me show you the predictor. The predictor picks up on those snow showers, snow flurries, especially if you're traveling just to the west of here over that higher terrain toward Altoona, you could see a few snow showers. Now, here comes high pressure, big blue H. We like that guy. It's going to calm the winds down tonight and give us a nice pleasant day tomorrow. Cold, but at least it won't be windy. For Sunday, high pressure moves out to sea. That'll give us a southerly flow. And even with some passing clouds at times on Sunday, it's going to be dry and it will be milder. Here's the seven day forecast. Check out the numbers. We have 52 on Sunday, even 54 for Veterans Day. But then the other shoe drops, right? Tuesday we go with 40 degrees. Wednesday, 36, Thursday, 42, and probably be in the 40s again next Friday.